Welcome everybody to Toasty's Adventures. I'm Toasty. As you can see here today, we are going to be fishing this glorious river slash creek. I will be bass fishing. I'll be using a different assortment of, I don't know why I did that. I'll be using a different assortment of lures, but we're going to be starting off with uh, square bill crankbait or chatterbait or diving bait, whatever you want to call it. And we're going to see if we can catch some bass. As you can see, it looks quite beautiful, and I'll be waiting in my waders, and I have my gear on my back. We're going to see how far we can go. We're going to head up the river, and hopefully catch some fish. Let's dive right into this video. Alright guys, like I said, we're going to be fishing upstream. We're going to be fishing that way upstream. I might try this little cove right here. I know this cove hides some big bass sometimes or maybe be fishing maybe off the side for a little bit it gets a little deep over there and then we're gonna go super far up on the ridge and go past to the more um deeper slower water where there's rocks and branches but let's start off right here i'll be using this um beautiful little lure by cream it's a crankbait it has like kind of square squarish round bill it's supposed to just look like a regular shad or minnow Especially me, it's a floating one, so it floats. But I'm hoping that they are after this today. We're kind of in spawn slash pre-spawn. So they're starting to spawn, but they haven't let yet completely spawn. So we'll see what they think. Might even catch, might even be able to catch some cool gills or something. Some bigger panfish or whatnot. Oh, there we go, guys. There we go, guys. Look at that. I knew there would be something in there. Haha. <laughs> well, I saw another one, too. I'm not going to use my net. Let's see. Let's stop spinning. Stop letting them. Don't let them spin. Ready? Grab him. Ah, oh, he went at it at a really weird angle. There we go, guys. Uh, just drop that it's not getting hooked okay look at that big old rock bass was not expecting that from right there he was underneath and he decided just to come up there was a smaller one that was looking at it and this guy just came up and grabbed it let's get a picture with this guy too let's see throw him back in gave him some good good oxygen hopefully he'll just swim away yeah i don't see him on top there was another fish down here. I'm probably going to try again right down there. That was cool. Let's go, guys. All right, guys. We're going to do the verse of the day today. Did I say today twice? Okay. We're doing the verse of the day right now. The verse of the day comes Ephesians 1, and it's 1.11. And it says, In him we have, been obtained, we have obtained an inheritance having been predestined according to the purpose of him who works all things according to the counsel of his will. Um, that can get kind of tricky, you know, um, you, you don't really know what that means. It's like predestined, you're going to be predestined, you're like, okay, there's a big controversy between that and I'm not going to get into that. Uh, but I believe that we are predestined and I believe that we have our own free will. I believe both. Um, I'm not going to get too much deeper into that part of it, but he has all things, like he has all things according to his will and to his counsel and whatever goes is because he chose, it goes. So whether I catch fish or not, he chooses that. Whether I get a car wreck on the way home, he chooses that, but that's, that's what I get from this verse and I hope it encouraged you right now. I don't know where you're at in your life, but I hope it encouraged you. And I encourage you to read the Bible, read Ephesians, it's a really good book. Let's get back to fishing. Oh, there we go guys, there we go. Wow, <gasps> no, that was a trout guys, that was a trout. No! 
That was like one of my last casts. I got a cast over there one last time. Okay, I got a cast over there one last time. Okay guys, I'm walking along the side of the river. The road's on the other side of me. You guys can't see that. But I was right down there in the river walking it. I almost caught a trout, which that was amazing that I almost caught a trout. Oh, that just, I'm still excited about that moment. We caught the rock bass, which is really cool. Really excited about that rock bass. Can't wait to see what else I catch next time I come to the river. The fish are becoming way more active. I love this creek. This creek's my favorite place to fish. I just go all over different parts of this creek and catch different species of fish. It's just awesome. But other than that, guys, thank you for joining. Like this video if you enjoyed my content or if you enjoyed this video. Share this video if you like, if you think other people in your family will like it. Subscribe if you think I have content you'd like. For now, I'm Toasty. This is Toasty Adventures, and I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye. Get a picture with this guy. Oh, no, 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 no. Nope, 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 nope. <laughs> this guy, nope. He's a fighter. Nope. Nope. <laughs> Man, I love fish that are fighters.